What's going on, everyone? Chris from PickDogs.com here with your free pick in the Toledo versus New Mexico college basketball matchup going down Tuesday, November 21st, 2023. Just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, the games I love the most, including my daily $19 best bet, make sure that you head on over to PickDogs.com and click the Premium Picks tab at the top of the page. But let's get to this one between Toledo and New Mexico. And Toledo coming into this one with a record of 3-0 on the year after a 78-77 win over Wright State on the road in their last matchup as 2.5 point dogs. Meanwhile, New Mexico coming into this one off a narrow 82-80 win over UT Arlington in their last game. Um, failing to cover as 14.5 point dogs, but still narrowly edging out the Mavericks in that game. And we'll start with the Lobos. I mean, I wasn't a huge fan of how they performed in that game. You know, they had a double-digit lead. You know, I think they were up 75-65, at least that's what I remember. Um, late in that game, and they, they were pushing for the cover. They were getting close, and then they just weren't hitting their shots. They took their foot off the gas. They they got caught coasting, and uh, and, and UC Arlington made a game of it. And uh, you can't have that happen, especially with a lot of decent teams coming up for UT Arlington. I mean, all, all within the next, you know, two weeks, or sorry, two to three weeks, they're playing Toledo to that, uh, to, on Tuesday, Rice on Wednesday, Pepperdine is a decent team as well. La Tech is ranked 113th. UC Santa Barbara, Santa Clara. So there's a lot of, lot of decent teams coming up for uh, for New Mexico. To the point, that, like I said, they can't take their foot off the gas. And uh, I think the Mountain West is going to be pretty loaded this year as well. So New Mexico got to focus up and, and get it going from the from the jump. But they are at least playing well. You know, they're, they're 15th, uh, top 15 adjusted offensive efficiency. They're not turning the ball over a whole lot. They're 42nd in turnover percentage on offense. The concern for me is the shooting numbers. Um you know, they're shooting 45.1% from two-point range, um, 275th in the country. And when 56% of your points are coming from two-point range, the 90th highest point distribution towards twos in the country, you got to kind of get that up, especially, you know, when you're going against this Toledo team that does play, you know, fairly lackluster defense against this New Mexico offense. I mean, this is an area where if New Mexico is going to at least improve those numbers, this is a spot to do it. Toledo, 357th. In two-point defense, um, like I said, just not numbers that you can afford. Toledo's offense is the better offense here by a fair margin. Uh, they're you know 41st in adjusted offensive efficiency, 27th in effective field goal percentage. They don't turn the ball over either. They're, they're the eighth best three-point shooting team in the country. But I think that the reason I'm leaning towards the Lobos here is the Lobos have the best defense on the floor, and you know they're top 30 in the country in three-point defense, which should negate some of that uh, that offense for the Rockets. Um, 127th and two point defense, which would take away a lot of the uh, the offense for uh, for Toledo. You know, Toledo relies on the two point shot as well to get a lot of their heavy lifting done offensively. They they rely on it more than Toledo than uh, than in Mexico does. You know, 57.9% uh, of Toledo's points are coming from two point range, 58th highest point distribution in the country. So you have two teams that rely on the on the two pointer. I want the team that's going to be able to defend them a lot better, you know, that than uh, the team that's given up, you know, 357th highest two-point percentage in the country. So, sorry, Toledo, but that defense has got to improve before you see any of my money. I'm going to take New Mexico in this one, lane the three, and that's going to be my free pick. But just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, you can find those at Pick Dogs Premium. While you're Pick Dogs, check out our betting tools. They're 100% free. They're the best betting tools in the business and tools that you want to make sure that you have in your back pocket when you're making your best bets for the day's action. And while you're at our YouTube channel, make sure you have notifications turned on so you can be the first to be in the know when the newest content drops here at Pick Dogs. Thanks for watching. See you guys soon.